Hey guys, my name's Theobald Hedman and you're watching Southern Ingenuity. Today's video, I'm gonna be highlighting this homemade tree pulling attachment that I made for my tractor. I'm gonna tell you a little bit about its design and how I built it, and I got plenty of footage of it in action coming right up. <laughs> This homemade tree pulling attachment is designed to operate from the three-point hitch of the tractor and except for the hardware, it's made entirely from old discarded scrap metal. It has a two inch thick solid steel stationary jaw welded to a two inch by four inch solid steel crossbar. The pivoting jaw is made from two pieces of one inch thick plate steel spaced apart by three quarter inch washers and bound together by three quarter inch grade eight bolts. The pivot bolts are one inch grade eight with nylon insert locking nuts to hold them in place. It has a vertical brush guard made from steel walkway grading and two legs on the back side that can be pinned in the up position when the unit is in use and then pinned in the down position for storage. The two and a half inch bore hydraulic cylinder and the 2700 PSI hydraulic system of the tractor work together to generate and apply over 13,000 pounds of force to the pivoting jaw. Now there's several factors that determine how big of a tree you can actually pull up. That includes moisture content of the soil, the soil composition, and the root structure of the tree. There's been cases when I've been easily able to uproot four inch diameter trees, but in others, a two inch tree wouldn't budge an inch and even brought the front tires off the ground. Well, that's all for this video i hope you enjoyed it if you did give it a thumbs up and if you haven't already click the subscribe button i got more videos coming soon until next time i'm theobald hedman and thanks for watching southern ingenuity